Last time with Tim, I just wanted to make sure that you guys know that this is for the error of the Blackberry. That is when you have a widescreen of that and the clock just keeps on ticking and ticking. And then when it goes to the black screen, it comes out with a red, you know, that alert thing and it just never goes away. And then it goes back to the white screen, then it just goes into an endless cycle of rebooting. And just remember, I'm not responsible for a Blackberry. I don't know why I'm talking so loud. But yeah. You're doing this at your own risk, but it should work because you're using a BlackBerry software to restart a BlackBerry device. Hello everybody, this is Tom with Tim, and today, this is a tutorial on how you fix a nuked BlackBerry on a Mac. Now, this tutorial is all my own ways. I couldn't find a tutorial on the internet. So, this while I'm doing it, first thing, and that's the most important, you'll need to download BlackBerry Desktop Manager. Alright, you're going to need to go, I'll put a link in the description, download the latest one. And then we're gonna go to desktop manager and I'm gonna block in my info alright so now we're gonna click retry or update so first you wanna click retry alright it doesn't work now we're gonna try to click update update it a message should pop up that says there's no BlackBerry device software installed in the connected BlackBerry device. The following version will be able to install your device. Basically, what's happened is that something has erased your whole BlackBerry. And now the only way to get back your BlackBerry is to, like, you know, install an OS, just like an iPhone or any other phone. You need an OS to operate it, not just the hardware. So, we're going to just go to the recommended one because I don't want to play with anything else. Include on with your your wireless service provider or if your device is working with the email account that use Blackberry Enterprise Server Control for blah 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 and click install. Do not disconnect your device until operation is complete. We're just gonna leave the device and I'm gonna come back when it's done. So just play around with your Blackberry while this is happening, you know. And just follow the instructions. I thought it was actually gonna be a little bit harder. Uh, I learned a few other ways, but I guess this way is working. I didn't expect it to work. And remember, you always download the most, and I mean the most updated version of the BlackBerry desktop software. Do not try any older versions, even if they claim to be, or from any other sites like they saying we have BlackBerry 5.0 software and stuff like that. Do not just go from BlackBerry desktop software. And try this method, because if it's a new BlackBerry, and you are on Mac, and you have no other available option unless you know have, you have a Windows PC in your home. Um, you're gonna need to buy a new BlackBerry, right? So might as well try to save your old one. So just try this method. Remember, I'm not responsible, but it pretty should work. I mean, it's BlackBerry desktop software, and I'm trying to use it to, to return my BlackBerry to life. Now you should have you know kept any backup of your BlackBerry Messenger things, you know. If you have, that's great. If you don't, I'm sorry. I uh, I I had bought some games for the BlackBerry, and I think they're gonna be deleted. Some cool games, even like um, I had FIFA 09, although it was not that good, but it you know it did have it was there on my phone. I had Worms, that was pretty cool. Yeah, so I'm gonna stop talking now, and you know you can just wait for this load, and I'm gonna come back when it does. Hello guys, Tom with Tim here. Inside my BlackBerry device, it says computer, and hopefully that's a good sign. Yep. Okay, so we've gone back to the small cursor, and it says waiting for device to restart. Do not disconnect your device. BlackBerry device software has been installed, and we're just gonna click restore data. Now, I do I want to restore data right now? Um. Okay, you know what? I'll click restore data. And now we are going to go to the Yep. So, yeah, that's basically it. So this is what's happening to my BlackBerry. Everything is okay. Everything is good. And now it says that it's done. And now we're going to open my BlackBerry. Ah, now it says please enter your device password to enter. I'm just gonna click. Um, I'm gonna enter my password now, so you can just look at my BB. And 
and I've entered my password and everything is done everything is set let's pick up the baby and now let's get back this handheld device so this property and confidential blah 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 okay okay boss and we are done with my blackberry and now I'm gonna unlock it now you view the screen now we're going back to the setup wizard it's designed to help you learn about the navigation and typing blah 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 okay okay and close Sorry. close you're about to exit the setup wizard with my name and 48 to reset okay everything is back the way it should be let's look at my games nothing there everything's just you know it's everything's just being restored it's a fully non-functional blackberry device the contact blah we're gonna do that later but as you can see your blackberry is now not more nuked it's nothing is wrong with it it's fast uh... I guess that's it let's see taking a picture as before there used to be a lag on taking my picture no, I have to, but I guess it opens faster now. Let's see in my. Oh, okay, that's it. So this was Tom with Tim, guys. Remember that I provided the first tutorial on how to unnuke your BlackBerry on YouTube on a Mac. So I don't know why I'm screaming. All right, Tom with Tim, guys, signing out. Peace. Oh, and I just forgot to add. You can always sync all your contacts, your notes, your I mean your contacts basically and your music from the Blackberry's Tech Store Manager providing you have them on your um, what do you call your computer and I'm guessing you do if you've used Blackberry Desktop Manager before or you've had an iPhone like me oh guys, so this, this is, is Tom it with Tim. Tom with Tim. and I've just synced my Blackberry and everything is there all my contacts uh, scrollers a little bit off don't know why it maybe it's because I've been playing with it a lot I just synced a lot of data on it so yeah okay yeah there it is working again so it's all there my music's there and everything's done you know let's see if any of my messenger contacts are still there where was messenger actually uh, messenger as I remember was somewhere in instant messaging no not there oh well and applications no alright bye it's all working time with Tim Signing up.